In this step, we are going to create a mesh for the computational domain. Let's go to Continua, right click, New, Mesh Continuum. In the models, double click, then we select Trimmer and uh, Prism Layer Measure. Close. Expand reference values in the base size. Change the base size to 5 millimeter. Right. Then we can see cylinder 1 and cylinder 2 are assigned to mesh 1 right now. Let's use this button here to generate mesh. Then there is an error coming out. That is because each region could only accept one mesh uh, rule. So if you would like to do both at the same time, uh, you could simply copy this mesh by Ctrl C, go to Continua, Ctrl V, then there will be a new mesh rule here. Let's rename the, the mesh, new mesh rule into mesh2 and right click in Continua. Oops. Right click in Continua. There is a refresh. So it refreshed the order of mesh 1 and mesh 2. Go to cylinder 1, make sure that is mesh 1. Cylinder 2 is mesh 2. They are actually exactly the same mesh, but because we have two different regions, so we need two different mesh rules. Right now we can mesh. Go to mesh button and it start to mesh. All right. Go to scenery and select mesh scene. So that's our how our mesh looks like. We could use transparent mode to see the object inside. All right, so that's our mesh right now. Let's go to each region. Make sure we create uh, uh, right boundary conditions. So at the inlet. By default, everything is in wall, and we need to change that to velocity inlet. Interface uh, is interface. We need to uh, also control another interface as cylinder two by using control button, and then right click. There's a function called create interface. Then this boundary will be considered as an interface. What it do is it will pass the information from upstream to downstream regions. Voice wall, so we don't need to worry about this. At the interface, it is interface already. This is the body inside. The outlet, we need to make sure the boundary is pressure outlet. Cylinder wall is cylinder wall, so we are good here. So that's uh, everything about mesh. Let's go to the next video to see more setup.